Hi, this is Habib from Preston Audi, and this is the Audi Q5 in S-Line spec. This particular model has the 2.0-litre TDI engine with 190 PS, the S-Tronic automatic gearbox, and Quattro four-wheel drive. This model has had one previous owner. Starting at the front of the car, you'll see the grille, which is unmistakably Audi, and matches models higher up in the range. We also have the S-Line front bumper, which comes as part of the S-Line exterior styling. As standard, we also have LED headlights, which you can see demonstrated here. This particular model is finished in stunning metallic Navara blue, which is complemented by the aluminium window trim strips and aluminium roof rails. As standard on this S-Line model, we have the 19-inch 5 twin spoke star design alloy wheels, which look handsome and complement the S-Line exterior styling perfectly. We also have S-Line badges on the front wings, as well as electrically adjustable and heated body coloured door mirrors with integrated LED side indicators. And if we move towards the back, you'll see we have privacy glass for the rear and rear side windows, as well as LED rear lights with dynamic rear indicators. As mentioned earlier, the S-Line exterior styling also adds the enhanced rear bumper, rear diffuser and roof edge spoiler, which definitely gives this car a more aggressive style over the sport model. To access the boot, you can press the button on the key or use a soft release on the power operated tailgate. As you can see, it opens up to a spacious boot with more than enough room for all of your belongings. And if you'd like to create more space, you can fold the rear seats. Once you've loaded everything, just press the button on the power operated tailgate and it will close for you. As you can see, this is a really stylish SUV with some great features. And if we move inside, there's a spacious interior with more than enough room for all passengers while the leather and Alcantara upholstered seats mean they can travel in luxury as well. Now that we've had a look at the exterior, let's have a look at the interior. And what a great interior this is. In front of you, there's a three-spoke leather high multifunction steering wheel with buttons to control the colour driver's information system and the infotainment system on the centre console. On the left hand side of the steering wheel, we have these toggle switches which you can use to change the display ahead. As you can see, we have a few display options. We have general car information which can display speed, consumption and driver assist, DAB digital radio and media, telephone equipment for your connected device, as well as navigation. And if you'd like, you can also have the minimum display on or off by clicking view. Moving to the centre console, we have the 7-inch MMI Radio Plus display screen. On the centre console, we have the MMI controller dial, which you can use to easily navigate through the menus while on the move. We also have the toggle switches with preloaded shortcut menus, such as DAB Digital Radio, media controls for your connected device with various sources such as USB, SD card and Bluetooth, telephone equipment for your connected device, as well as navigation. And you can even use the MMI controller dial to zoom in and out of the map. Not only that, but we also have the smartphone interface which allows you to connect your device media directly into the display. Moving down, we have the display for the three zone electronic climate control, which are separate controls for the front passenger, rear passengers and driver, with plenty of configurability to your liking. You can easily change the temperature or speed on the move by using the easy to access toggle switches. Not only that, but on this model we also have heated front seats. As standard, we have drive select which allows you to alter the driving dynamics by choosing one of the pre-configured modes. As you can see, there are plenty of modes to choose from, such as comfort and auto, but our personal favourite is dynamic as it's the most driver focused. And even though this spec is very highly equipped, we also have the optional reversing camera. There's also leather and Alcantara upholstered front sport seats, as well as matte brushed aluminium inlays for the dashboard. As you can see, this is an impressive interior, blending high quality materials and build quality with some great technology. Even though this car is like new inside and out, it has done 20,498 miles, and it comes with a set of original keys. This was the walk around of the Audi Q5 S line. If you'd like to arrange a viewing or test drive, please contact us. Thank you for watching.